This is an update from the summer of 2015. Audacity 2.1.1 is out. One of the major differences in this new version of Audacity is the noise removal tool is now called the noise reduction tool, which actually brings it in line with what most people call it, noise reduction. So I'm going to show you how to use that, which is different from the noise removal tool from the earlier versions. So here I've recorded my voice. Take a listen in headphones if you can. Testing, one, two, three, testing. Now you hear a lot of noise right in this area. So what we want to do is sample that noise. Go to Effect and notice that it's called Noise Reduction, not Noise Removal. Click on that. And here we're going to click Get Noise Profile. And it's going to sample what you've highlighted. So click that button. And now you've collected the profile of this particular noise. Now unselect everything in the track and open Noise Reduction again. And notice this time that it automatically selects everything because you didn't have anything selected. So it assumes that you've already got your noise profile now. So just go ahead and click OK. And you can see that some of that noise went away here. Let's take a listen. Testing, one, two, three, testing. So that sounds much better, doesn't it? Not only did they change the name, but the tool is actually much improved as well. Now, sometimes you may not want to apply noise reduction to all of your audio. If that's the case, make sure you have selected the audio that you do want to treat for noise reduction. In this case, I'm going to treat the audio right before the voice comes in, and I'm going to leave everything else alone. So now if I click Effect, and noise reduction, you notice that it doesn't select the entire audio file. And you can just click OK, and it will only treat the audio before the voice. Testing, one, two, three, testing.